pants off. 26? Wait, more importantly, I don't think I turned the sound on. Fig. Sound. The sound is the least important part of this game. True. Oh, good. Mainly the sound coming from our end. Yeah. Because that's the part everyone hates. The words that come out of our mouth are virtually useless. No, wait. Actually useless. I didn't realize, or I had forgotten, that the subtitle to this game was The War Against Gygax. Sounds like a personal problem to so, me, homie. So, so when did we start? Uh, it was back when we were t telling the people about how much they hate us. Self-deprecating humor is the most. Did you get all? Did you get that fantastic joke we had for Mother's Day and Mother Two? No. Oh, you didn't get that. That joke okay, is well, lost. It's, it's not gonna play again. So like, we might as well just not. not tears even. in the ring. Where'd you get your mom for Mother's Day? A uh, wind chime and a stupid like ladybug lawn ornament thing. I also made her a card, and I'm gonna take her out to eat. Badass. I got my mom. When'd you get your? I got her some uh, some gourmet cupcakes. Does does she like cupcakes? Does anyone not? Are there people on this on using up my air to fuel their filthy biological processes that don't? This is dumb. Yeah, she, she likes cupcakes. muffins, right. honestly. It's not, I mean, like a, a cupcake and a muffin are, are pretty much indistinguishable, the only difference being the presence of icing, right? Yeah. And I'm just not big on icing, so if you're gonna give me the option, I'd probably rather just have a muffin. Well, okay, they're, no, they're really not the same, are they? I think a, a muffin really seems more, like, wholesome than a cupcake. A cupcake seems like, like it's gonna be garbage with or without the icing. I, I, I think a cake implies a certain fluffy airiness. Like, I, I think a pound cupcake would be weird, as cupcakes go. Like a pound cake that is just a cupcake form. But, like, you wouldn't cast a glance askance at, at like, a really stout muffin. Well, okay, well, what is a quick bread? Are these quick breads? Yeah. Is a cake a quick bread? A any kind of, oh, I, I think a cake can be regularly leavened, but generally, uh, a quick bread is anything that's not leavened with yeast. And, well, I mean, a, and a cupcake is leavened with sugar, right? Uh, no, sugar does not provide leavening. Uh, they, they're all, they, these will all be leavened with baking powder, or baking soda and an acid. Sugar helps, though. It, or it can't... Wait, what am I doing? For some reason, I remember from my food science class that sugar was a leavening in some, in some case. Maybe when it's being used to feed uh, yeast. Oh, maybe that was it. Maybe it was just the connection there. I don't remember. <laughs> food science class was a class that I... What a waste. What a waste of, like, $500. Although I remember from... Uh... From an episode of Good Eats at some point, uh, talking about, uh, like when you... God, what am I trying to say here? Uh, like when you, when you cream sugar and butter together when you're making cookies, uh, the, the little, like, holes that the, the, you mash into the butter helps produce bubbles when the time comes in the cookie dough, when it's cooking. Like, it creates space for, for the leavening to, to do its work. Yeah, I thought it was something like the sugar, like, explodes or something as it's baking and, and gives it that. Hmm. But maybe, maybe it is the baking soda that does that. Maybe it's the sugar. Whatever. I, I hate food. I don't eat food. I'm a robot. Drink this delicious oil. This delicious whale oil. Some seasonings. 
Why is someone's why is there a kiosk in the middle of a mall that sells nothing but seasoning? Dude. Have you seen those kiosks at, at the mall? Nobody needs any of that stuff. It's always <laughs> some weird thing like like some sort of remote controlled helicopter or I don't know like crucifixes or something like that. Every oh oh god, it's this guy. Hey buddy. Little co covers for your cell phone. <laughs> Oh my god, what's a hyper beam? I don't care, I want it. Let's go. Wait. Wait, before you... What? We, we had rules about what kinds of guns we could buy. What? Remember you said some type of gun was ineffective? Oh, um... Giving Naomi and Lars slingshots makes them miss, like, 20% of the time. So we're not gonna give them... But Rob Z can't use anything but guns. Maybe that was it. Okay, cool. His, his offense... There were no rules about points. guns. It's like... Because we had an air gun at one point. Yeah. Oh, man. Speaking of air guns... Yes. And this is, this is going to harken back to something we were talking about before, but we might as well let the uh, audience in on it. The Olympics! Yes. What a weirdo sort of affair that is. It's strange that it's all supposed to be very... Tell... Well... T tell them what you... what you... I... 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 Lay, the, lay down the rules of marksmanship in the Olympics. Okay, so, uh... B basically the thing that made you flip out, and which will send you into some kind of... I feel the need to mock you, but I can't do it. I lack the it, words. Because I'm not, I'm not, you know, blameworthy. You're a madman. My, my response to this was completely reasonable. Any reasonable man would respond to hearing this in the same manner I did. I will destroy you utterly. Oh my god, See, what is all this? The only reason you're not just agreeing with me right now is that you're not a reasonable man. Oh. At any rate, the thing that made you trip out was you were talking about, um... <laughs> you, make it, you make it sound like it's some kind of drug. <laughs> like, oh god, he found out that they use air guns in the Olympics and I was flipping out. Oh, bro, he took a hit off this compressed air and he started flipping, man. I don't think getting, I don't think inhaling compressed air does anything to your body that regular air does. Oh, oh, okay, but the, the only real news was that they use very specifically regulated air guns yeah. for the marksmanship competition. And it just got me to thinking, so the Olympics is supposed to be this, like, a way for, in our, in our modern globalized society, to recall these sorts of ancient, uh, and like, for nations to connect with one another in terms of these ancient, sort of universally understood athletic competitions. Sure. But, the way we've, like, warped them, uh, in the interest of fairness, and makes them... If you were going to become an Olympic marksman, you would have to train to be an Olympic marksman. You couldn't train to be a marksman. Because the kind of gun you use in the Olympics has no application other than in Olympic marksmanship. Right. It's not like you can be a good at shooting guns. It's not like you can... If you just happen to have a twenty two rifle you know, around, and you're real good at hitting that bullseye. Wait. That doesn't mean anything. This is topical. We've reached Olympics. the sports store. Perhaps we can buy some Olympics. Oh, we're at Academy. <laughs> they sell both the sports and also the outdoors. Is a cat The right stuff, the right price. Academy! Is that, is that the same academy? No, you're thinking of Plato's Academy. That's where you get the right stuff at the right place. Oh, academy Sports right and Outdoors is where you go to learn about learning. Like, learn about how to know things. Don't be stupid, Andy. That's deep, man. Learn about how to know things. 
<laughs> I know how to know gonna, things. You're an idiot. Go to ancient Athens to get my sporting equipment. <laughs> get my compound bows and my <laughs> catcher's mitt. Yeah. <laughs> Some advanced socks that will not make your feet smell bad. Some badminton set. Yeah. <laughs> you know, maybe That's a shotgun and a couple of boxes of ammo while you're there at the Parthenon. <laughs> uh, oh man, they've got Star J. That's my favorite game. But anyway, I mean, I, I just found that rather uh, ironic is not the right word, because... But, uh, uh, like, absurd, you know, yeah. just sort, sort of ridiculous that it's supposed to be this idea of recalling these ancient or universally understandable athletic competitions. Uh, uh, that sort of, like, cross-cultural and linguistic barriers and all that, and yet, it, it's so refined and so, uh, uh, um, well, refined is the word, but, uh, that you can't get into it unless you get into it in the particular way yeah. that they have established one can be into it. It'd be, it'd be like if you showed up to the, uh, uh, it's like if you showed up with like a solid steel pole for the pole vault, they'd be like, "Are you insane? That's not how you pole vault anymore." And it just seems it seems strange that that is a thing. Also, I wonder this... where pole pole vaulting pole vaulting came from. Was there like a way to scale walls or something? Like, did that have any actual application as? Anything but a sport. I don't know. But now uh, we have a uh, we have hyped ourselves okay, up. Okay, yeah, a bunch we're of playing a video game, here. aren't we? We're not we're not doing anything that's that's part of the Olympics. A video? What? Oh man. I wonder if they ever will be. Video games in the Olympics? Yeah. <laughs> can't see fool. me thumbing my nose at you. Do you bite your thumb at me, sir? Do you mock me? Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, non-linguistic communication. <laughs> Perfect. What is that rat? Smash oh. that rat. What the f- what the f- Oh, oh, it's Roberto! <laughs> <laughs> you saw him, didn't you? Yeah. Uh-oh, someone wants our attention. Your attention, please! Please proceed to the office. I was Would a just Mr. There. Lars please report to the front desk? Your mother is waiting for you. Oh, God. Did you ever, did uh, your mother ever do that whoa, to you? What the hell is that? It's a, uh, it's one of those... It's a scalding coffee cup. Hmm. Oh! At least it's a new enemy type. It's not another snail or a... I don't know, what are some of the other enemy... It's not another one of those... Dude, this thing is doing an unbelievable amount of damage to us. You're meant to lose, don't even try. Jesus oh. Christ. I guess you weren't meant to lose. Don't listen to Andy. I, I not like I haven't ever played this game. Ugh. That thing took away like... <gasps> Lord have mercy, it nearly killed Rob. Did... So did, did that alien, like, say anything? No, he just, Is... like, burst onto the scene and absconded with our lady. So why, is, why are the lights out? Are you in a different dimension, or are the lights just out? I think the lights are just out. But when, we, um, when we walked in, that mouse said he predicted that the lights would go out. That's strangely specific, but okay. I think that mouse was working for the enemy. Jeez Trick yo yo! Uh, I better use some life up, I guess. 
15. Oops. Sorry, crap. Naomi had a bunch of our healing items and stuff, too. Still haven't figured out what that, that letter is supposed to be. Oh, yeah. I think I think it's supposed to be a gamma and the the, the loop. The, the descender on the gamma is just really, uh, really big. Yeah. That seems reasonable. Oh. That was nice. I guess that first one just hit us. Yeah, no shit. I killed a coffee cup and it dropped a cup of coffee. <laughs> I have a coffee cup right here. I hate coffee. I hate you. I don't hate you. You don't like anything, Baxter. No. Well, that's not true. You like hamburgers. I like soda and booze. Oh, crap. That's true. You do like a... A good diversity of booze. I... It's a mystical record. <laughs> it's also a joke record. It's... <laughs> it's gonna, like, deliver a comedy skit or something? It is susceptible to brain shock, whatever that means. Does it have little arms? Is that what that is? Yeah, it just have little arms and legs. <sighs> Enemy design, man. <laughs> I don't know, it's a record, and we give it arms and a face, and that's it. Uh, bro, right? Come and hit this compressed air and check out this record. <laughs> I like how it's a... It's like a vinyl record, too. <laughs> I mean... What, what is this? Not, where are we here? 1994? Yeah, were, were CDs around? Didn't CDs come out in the 80s? Oh, yeah. CDs were all through the 80s, man. Crap. That is too many... Why is that coffee purple? That's more of a magenta. Or like a maroon, I think. Whatever it is, it's an... I am outraged by it. Well, it's because it's actually wine, and <laughs> they're just calling it coffee because, you know, kids can't drink. Good lord. I think Rob Z is about to die. No! In Japan, a country where children of all ages Shit. are drinking all the time. That's perfectly fine. This is F, dude. Yeah, we, we passed the threshold at some point. We should have leveled up more. I... I... Ground my ass off in that desert. Did you? Yeah. Was I not here? Yeah, I mean that's that's what I did while the the, the people were away. Oh really? So you did? You just yeah. leveled up a little bit? Uh, I feel like I leveled up a bunch. I spent like a couple of hours playing this game, just wandering around the desert fighting stuff and not advancing the plot. God's Dude. sake, <laughs> Lars. Well, I mean, okay, but you're 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 regaining some. Maybe it's a matter of uh like what happens sometimes when you level up in in a single area like that is you'll be gaining levels, but you'll be missing like some essential item or attack or something that you're gonna get in this area. Yeah, that might be so. Jeez. Well, Maybe it's supposed to be really hard until we, like, get the thing. Uh, also, we're missing one of our party members. Yeah. So. Please hurry to Naomi. Ah! Shit. This is not going to end well. Leroy! Oh, hey, two packages! Three! <laughs> it must be my birthday. I hate my birthday. My birthday is soon. Don't forget. You had nine days, right? Yeah. Went through your, uh, Amazon... Wish list and Don't say anything my mother of... isn't allowed to hear. <laughs> Interesting material in there. Oh, it's a disaster area. You have a lot of like you want two rulers. And, and also some a spicy pad of crystal board. You want a five hundred dollar air pistol. Yes. And again, some spicy pornography. I, I don't remember any part. Of, there, there was one Shit. piece of pornography in there, and it was one rather humorous piece of pornography. <laughs> Got our asses stomped. Goodness. 
I saw that coming 200,000 miles away. Well, uh, Christ. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> no, no sir, I am I'm not. I'm gonna shred serious. on this enemy. <laughs> it's got a little face. Good God almighty. I like how its leg is the whammy bar. <laughs> Eat a dick! That's what that thing is called, right? That little lever. Yeah. Like a guitar. Yeah, yeah. Whammy bar. We need to get the hell out of here. Hello? What? You have a brother? Oh. No, that that was our sister calling us. Uh, oh. Since you know about the item. Oh, uh, she's calling us because Naomi was holding a plot item. Uh, so we need to go to the. Oh, and, and so she gave it to the Escargot Express. Yeah, that way they can hang okay. on to it. In case we need it for. It... That must mean that Naomi's gonna be gone for a while. Yeah. Where's the hotel? Oh, there's the hotel. We need to go to the hotel and sleep. Uh... I need to go see that hint guy. Maybe he can help us out. He's over by the hotel. Jeez, that was brutal. Oh man. What were we talking about before this game became like ridiculously hard for no reason? Uh, we were talking about the Olympics, and then. I don't remember. Okay. We don't need to be talking to. We need to, we need to focus. We need to get shit done. Follow those footprints. There were footprints? Go back outside. No. Hitting the nap, the nap zone first. Okay, take a nap, and as soon as you're done, go back outside. Sold. Whatever you do, don't steal the Bible out of it. Look, man, to hell with the Gideons. Uh. Now, footprints, you say? See? On every, uh, on the sidewalk, oh. there's like muddy footprints. I see. Maybe those aren't footprints. Maybe that's just the texture on the texture and massive sarcasm quotes on the sidewalk. Oh no, we need to go into the department store. God. This is fucked. We better. Oh, this is the game, man. That was fucked. <laughs> oh, hello, musical record. <laughs> it says they're susceptible to brain shock. Uh. Is okay, hypnosis, hypnosis is, a, is a thing. I mean, that affects the brain, right? Psych psychology and all that. I guess. Also, they're all faster than large, which is really irritating. And they also do just a completely unreasonable amount of damage. Of course it doesn't Faster work. than the speed of large. Yes. Gotcha. Faster than the speed of large. Also, they keep healing themselves. These are getting just tremendous hot stacks of experience points. See, that in itself makes me skeptical. Like, okay, well, you spent all that time leveling up, but what good did it actually do? Because you're probably getting so little yeah. experience from each thing. Of course, there's another one. Oh, God, this is. I guy. really wish. 
it, it, it were more of a... I, I wish you were more capable of evading these enemies. Yeah. Offense, defense. He is... Jesus. Everything he does just has a billion points of damage. Great. Whatever boss is at the top of the tower is going to suck. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe maybe the boss by the time we get to the boss will this will all be chump change. That's possible. Yep. Full power! Of course he did. And he killed Robsy. Quick hit him with a. This is too slow. Well. This is awful. Yeah, this is. I think it hits twice, too. Did you miss something? Uh, it has to be. Like, this is... Like, this just doesn't make any no. sense. You, you, there must be a... a... intermediate area where... that you've missed. This, this Maybe is it's in the museum or something. Yeah, this is way too hard. There's no way. There's no way this is where we're supposed to be. Yeah. How long have we been doing this, by the way? Ooh, uh, let's see. I, I forgot what time we started. Well, uh, what time is it now? We started around about midnight my well, time. I mean, we started thinking about doing this at about midnight. Oh, yeah, but then it was about another 15 minutes before we actually got it rolling. So, uh, we're, prob we're probably right at about 30 minutes right now. Well, let's go, let's get this. Oh, crap, this isn't where I need to be. You go to the hospital first. Ugh. We're probably a little over, we're probably a little over thirty minutes actually. Okay. Well, let's give it a few more minutes to see if we can make even one iota of progress. If we can even just figure out what where we're supposed to be. Yeah. But I almost wish there were more there were more to like help confirm things in this game. Yeah. Like am I in the right place? Or, um, it, the game really doesn't help you with that. No, it's like, just like there were like, I I recall that time where we completely just missed that section with Mr. Car Painter. Yeah, and we like bypassed them and just went out slammed our heads against those bears for like 3 hours until we were powerful enough I mean, to... but, And we had no idea. Like, we had no idea where we were supposed to be. Yeah. Ugh. So, so... There was a... There was a... A... Quote, dungeon... In the desert, right? Yeah. And we did that. Yeah. And That's I'll... where we fought... Number three. Correct. Oh, we fought number three and now we're in, five times. Now we're in four side. Yep. Are you sure it saved all that? Yeah, yeah. Remember yeah. last time, in the last ep I actually it wasn't the last episode, but there was that one time that it, we just forgot to save, and we're all such as fuck. Yes. But no, I'm, I'm sure I've saved our progress, because we actually... Otherwise, we would have started here. Okie dokie dokie. Hello. Mr. Spoon. Did you ever find a dinosaur? No. 
This douchebag isn't going to get out of the way and let us go in that room. So this place is a total to bust. Find him a dinosaur. Yeah. He wants photographs of living dinosaurs. Okay, we need to find a camera, then you need to find a dinosaur. No, we just need to get that asshole who comes down from space, kick his ass, mm. take his camera. You're right, he does have a camera. No, wait. He doesn't because the, 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 the aperture, like, Iris is in from the edge of the screen. Mm. The man himself has no camera. I have a camera! I am the camera. Oh, God. Uh, nope. Not this time, asshole. Blue man. Hey, a helicopter. He's gonna get that helicopter. I demand you get that helicopter. I'm gonna do my my double damnedest. Is that uh was that building uh Pokey's business? Yeah. Maybe we need to go talk to him. Maybe he'll be able to shed some light on us. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. Like, like we're that's cool enough to talk to Pokey. Anywhere. Yeah. Great. What about you? <laughs> this elevator is for Master Pokey's use only. Well, here we go. <laughs> Gentlemen. Gentiles. Goddamn Gentiles. What up, pokes? No, oh, pigs. That's, that's a good one, Pokey. You sure are a comic genius. <laughs> oh no. That, that's it? He just threw us out? He said some stuff we've seen before. Well, now that Pokey has some black folks in his employ, he's just too cool for the rest of us. Whoa. Easy, Mr. Minch. What was behind that plant? Was there a door behind that plant? No, it's just got like a stupid looking... Like the plant oh. is not transparent in that part, it just has a really... It has a... Yeah. It's... Oh, I, yeah, th those have the same thing. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, I'm, I'm thinking of anything. Did it get dark while you were... It, like... it was just color, right? Yeah. Okay. The lady's really concerned about me looking at her hips. I'm more concerned with why she's the same height as a child. Well, that was useless. Yeah, what a waste of time. Uh. That's it. It's, it's, we have exhausted the places that we can go. We can go back okay. to the desert. Well, we, I mean, there wouldn't be two, two dungeons in the desert. There's Maybe this is it. Maybe you just have to tough this out. Maybe this is this is the point. Yeah. It's supposed to be hard. Just gotta grind out these extremely tough enemies. Ugh. Try, try just every attack on them. Alright, okay, let me see, let me see what hitting with the uh, paralysis does. That was stupid. Ugh. No joy. And now we're asleep. And now he's going to shock us to death. Oh, 
just woke up. Yeah, no shit. That weird guitar electrocuted me. <laughs> Take it! Awesome. Of course. For God's sake! Is there an item that prevents electrical damage? There was, uh, the Franklin badge. What did that do? Uh, prevent- it stopped a lightning attack, I think? Maybe we need that. Yeah, go get your Franklin badge. You didn't throw that away, did you? It's, it's with the, um, delivery service. And of course, I'm in right. the wrong direction again. We need to go to the hospital first. I want all the Franklin badge. Let's go to the Franklin Mint and get some 24 karat gold clad collector proofs. <laughs> you know, for people who are ignorant. I would spend all the Franklins to get the Franklin badge. Benjamin Franklin or Dave Franklin's? I read uh, a essay written by Benja Benjamin Franklin recently called "On Farting." S sorry, what? It's a satirical paper that Benjamin Franklin wrote about farting, about how to make your fart smell good. <laughs> what was he satirizing? Uh. Uh, apparently there was some, uh, like, call for, uh, scientific papers in a French periodical of some kind, uh, and he responded like, well, there are all these other papers addressing these questions of, you know, this and that, but no one has addressed the very pressing concern of farts being all stinky. We all fart all the time, and it's rather impolite because of the noxious smell that, you know, and it goes on kind of like that. Yeah, that's awesome. It's pretty funny. I don't know. I just sort of came across it. It's not like I had any purpose in reading this, so I don't read it particularly close. No, you know, you're doing a, a literature review about farting. Yeah. All the flatulent <laughs> literature available. <laughs> that would actually be rather, rather cool to do. <laughs> I want to ensure of you on farting. You call this guy go express. Oh no! Oh, for God's sake! I don't want the pencil or shit. I have literally no need for that stupid eraser. We are never going to encounter another enormous iron pencil. You just picked the wrong item. No, like that. That was there was no other choice. Great, thanks, asshole. Thanks for the pencil it eraser. Made, it made you pick the pencil eraser. Why? No, like is it is it like a cue or something? No, th like there was no option at any point in the conversation. I skipped through the dialogue like as most of it's inane bullshit. Uh, Escargo Express. Yeah, let's, let's go! Oh crap. I'm an idiot. I need a delivery. You're handling this in just the poorest manner. <laughs> I I <can> Yeah, I can cover the $20 bill with the 13 grand in my pocket. Like, I mean, do, do you have any redeeming qualities? Virtually As none. A... <laughs> that. I mean, come on, give me something here. Anything. <laughs> Be a man, for God's sake. <laughs> uh... Sudden guts, pal. I had sudden guts once. It hurt. You swallow it and just a pile of intestines falls out of the sky. <laughs> <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> I 
What would I ever do with a pair of dirty socks? I'm keeping them. Quest to item. You know it's gonna be. Yeah. Did you ever see that Rocco's Modern Life episode where they they want to make designer coffee, so they make it out of dirty socks? No, but now I feel like I have. Y you pretty much have. Yeah. That was it. Funny show, though. I love Rocco's Modern Life. Alright. We need them to deliver something to us. Bring me... Franklin badge. Yes. And bring me some... Bring me the Franklin badge! Release the Franklin! Bring me the heart of the Franklin badge. <laughs> Sure, bring me a broken pipe. Whatever. Yep. Oh. Naomi danced for us and demanded the head of the Franklin badge. <laughs> All right. Goods. Help me, Franklin Badge. A lightning attack. Well, that could just be the translation. You know, it's like, it deflects the, the present lightning attack. Oh, I guess I should equip it too. Equip. Where do you equip a badge? Other? I think just having it on you is what did it earlier. This game sure does like loading you down with a bunch of irrelevant bullcrap. RPG, man. Alright, let's see if we can get through one fight without being gruesomely murdered. Maybe the point is to try to avoid all this crap. Maybe so. Maybe we have to s scoot up there. Yeah, take it! Well, that wasn't so hard. Uh, they seem to vary wildly in strength. Nope! Nope! Go up. Go, uh, go around it. Go around it the long way. Lead it up there. Like, like, okay, lead the package up to the Xerox machine, and then run bo back around and below it. Ah! And then, oh. Disaster. You, you, you have the reflexes of a, I don't know, ground sloth. <laughs> Shoot that record. Whoa. Are you getting yeah. this trip out for you too? Frame rate just went. Okay. Hey, why are we going to go ahead and save our games because something terrible happens? This thing has become useless in the last couple of seconds. Hit it with Psy Fell again. Blap! Has anything even used the lightning attack yet? Is it deflecting it? That's the, that's the lightning attack. Great! It's not now Robsy is dead. It. Maybe it's because Lars has it. No, before the... That's possible. Give it to Rob Z. <sighs> Shit. Shit. So... And why are these all in packages? I would like to know the same thing. Did it, it never gave any explanation for that? No. Okay. This, for some reason, this seems really, this seems a lot easier this time. I don't think it has anything to do with the Franklin badge. No. But, I mean, you're killing them now. Because I, like, I'm, I'm also, like, rapidly running out of juice for my powers. You're not even trying to avoid them, though. They're, look how fast they move. Ah, 
I think you can get away from that. I, th I think you can maneuver them around and swing, you know, swing around them and get to the other side. Oh my god, die! Go up the down escalator. Impossible. You're a madman. Try it. It won't even let you get on it. No. I could probably get up an up down escalator. I could probably get up a down escalator. There's no uh, okay, chance. That you, yeah, that you couldn't have avoided. That, that's fine. That was gonna hit you no matter what. Burn, you little fuckers. That's right. Burn, baby, burn. No, don't burn that baby. It's Disco Inferno. In her what? Inferno. So maybe, maybe the employees could help us. They're probably in on it, though. Okay, be prepared. Don't just run in. Go in slowly. You think go this way slowly? Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. It, oh! There goes the frame rate again. Oh, God. Uh, no, no, no. Get. Uh. Uh, that's not even fair! <laughs> they, get a, like, they get a free shot on us. What the fuck? And of course, they just. Yeah, they put us to sleep and then kill one of us outright. Oh my god! Did you see that? Yep. The Franklin badge worked. Yeah, shock me again, motherfucker. Jesus. Are you serious? Oh. Uh -huh. Die. That's a pretty good idea on my part, what do you say? Yeah, good call. I helped. I did one thing to progress this game. <laughs> I've got your number, Mother 2. Not We're as into as your Mother 2. Is that the one I said earlier? I hate you. Yeah. I just stole that joke from you. you, you when I said it on bastard. film. I mean on It's not about what you know, it's about what you can prove. See, what the f <sighs> Christ. See, I don't even I, I don't even have enough PP to heal myself. Take a eat a cookie. No uh heals PP. Oh, oh, I have a side caramel. Shit. That's, I mean, you can use it in battle, right? Yeah. Hit him! Yes! What? Okay, when, once, you, once you get out of this, I think, well, now, now it's irrelevant, but the next time uh, we have Rob Z as a... Yes. Get it. Life up. Boom. We'll survive long enough to be killed. Of course I missed. Yep. Life up. No, I don't have any PP. Right, you. Well, you have one. You have one. <laughs> it's going to be... Okay. It's gone. We need to stop, man. We're way over time now. Yeah, I'll give another shot. Fuckers. If you want to give it one more shot... <sighs> no, I do not. But, I mean, we're, we're way... We're probably... Probably an hour into this by now. Yep. Let's call it. You're gonna run, at the front of the you're department You're gonna run store. out of hard drive space. Yeah. In this video. So... Okay. We made... Zero progress. Well, we got to the department store, at least. 
so. And we figured out that the Franklin Badge helps. Yeah, it. it helps against all electrical attacks, which is cool, I didn't know that. So, maybe, maybe between this episode and the next, I'll just walk into and out of that department store 75 times and fight a thousand battles. And level up some. So we're baller enough to handle it next weekend. I'll catch you guys For later. For some reason, I feel... Oh. Well, well, hold on. Sorry. Get ahead For some reason, I feel like that would be cheating. You know? Whereas, before, when you just leveled up in the desert, that was one thing. But because we're sort of in an impasse right now, I feel like we need to let the audience see this process of us figuring this out. I guess. I mean, okay, if, if all you do is run in and out of the building and bat and you really brute force it that way, yeah. Then, I mean, if you do it, we just need to let them know. Okay. Okay. So if suddenly we'll we have seventy-five thousand dollars next time, you people know why. We'll let we'll let you folks know. Yeah. Whoever's listening, hey YouTube, hey. Listen. Hey! Hey! Can you hear me? Listen! Hey! Whatever. Listen! Fuck you, YouTube. Hey! We'll do whatever we want. This is our game. Hey. I designed this game. It's my 